Hey guys, welcome back to Yo-Kai Watch 3 and oh my gosh, you saw me on this is the funniest part And then they live happily ever after. Isn't that amazing? Uh, it's okay, I guess and I'm going to be the greatest detective ever Uh, All right, and who's <laughs> so indifferent um oh my god <laughs> You know, might be my favorite character ever just because of these memes. Oh my gosh. This girl is crazy and Usapian, you don't believe I'll be the greatest detective ever, do you? I don't even know what you're talking about. You literally just uh, what is wrong? What is going on with you, Inaho? Truth be told, I don't even know what's wrong with me. I just am like this. Anyways, Usapian, we should try and be the greatest detectives ever, don't you think? What is wrong with you? Come on, please. Play detective with me. Come on. It'll be fun. Why not? Do it. Come on. I don't really have a choice, I guess. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um. Really? Usapion, you really want to be detectives with me? No, I don't. But I... Uh, uh, you know what? Usapion's a trooper, man. And we begin at chapter three of Inaho's campaign, The Great Detectives. I know one word of kanji there, but the, uh, the rest, and all right, Usapion, are you ready to go? First, what's the first thing we need to get, though? I don't know, isn't this your adventure? Oh, I know, we need a detective outfit. A detective outfit? I mean, we could just, we're, we're, should we be undercover if we're detect- Eh, whatever, fine. Where the heck do we get one? Hmm. Bottom result might know, and you know, I don't really know either. You should know this stuff before you want to play detective. Fine. And uh, yeah, now we get to name the detective agency, I guess. So we're gonna name it. Um. Uh, <laughs> that'll do. <laughs> How about this? Music note star star question mark music note exclamation point question mark. That is really really long. You know what? Fine, we'll just call it Detective Agency. Mister, I don't like saying words on me before letters. It uh, rolls out off the tongue, doesn't it? Lady, you are absolute nuts. Yeah, kinda. <laughs> oh. You know, was that you screaming re like four minutes ago? Um. Yeah, no, yes. Well, that's weird. Anyways, could you do me a favor and leave the house? I just, I just don't like looking at you, to be frank. Okay, mom, no problem. <laughs> You're so a small Ashley sneeze. Anyways, so in this episode, we're gonna be starting on basically the section of Inaho's campaign, and I'm honestly extremely confused since we're already getting this far in Ino, Inaho's like part of the story. But it's kind of weird because Nate's kind of just left hanging. I don't understand if I can progress the plot or not with Nate's story. But he's still on chapter two, and it feels a tiny bit weird for, like, Nate to not be the main focus, you know? But if you come over to an I any iPo, it has this little icon, and it gives me the impression that there's more stuff to do on her side of the story and not Nate's. But, oh well, I guess we'll just let the game, you know, decide for ourselves and where to go and such. And what on earth was that noise? Oh my gosh. That was really weird. I thought that was I thought that was outside was actually in the game, but yes, what we're actually supposed to do in this game is head over to our elementary school in Uptown Springdale. Oh, I love this place, man. And there's Bear and Eddie, but alas, no Katie. <laughs> Wait, I think Katie was there too, huh? Anyways, so now that we're here, let's go to elementary school. Okay, you know, you know, I'm gonna be honest. If I was Usapion, I would just be the most I don't want to do anything, man. I mean, if you think about it, why wouldn't he just want to go hang out with- Well, I guess the professor can't really see him and stuff after what we saw in the last video, but now that we're here in Uptown Springdale, there is something I desperately want to do as quickly as I can. So, you guys know me by now. I love my just QR codes. I don't know why I love Yokai Metal so much. I just stinking do. And now that we have access to Uptown Springdale, <gasps> we can start scanning some QR codes. Now, I can't sadly show this process to you on screen because it kind of interferes with the way I record, but I've left a website with a giant database of QR codes for you to scan if you're playing the game at home. But if you're not, don't sweat it. 
I'm gonna scan a bunch of QR codes by talking to this lady, and then we're gonna hopefully put them into the Crankicon machine in this video. So let me do that real fast. And all right, I am done scanning all the QR codes. Now, there are way more QR codes that I could potentially scan right now, but I just decided to start with a couple of few coins because honestly, why the heck not? But let's see what we got as far as our codes going. Okay, so we got a five-star coin, pretty darn strong. We got two sushi coins, which I have no idea what these do, and this special coin I've never actually seen before. Hopefully, by the end of this episode, we'll be able to put these in the Cranky Kai machine and see what we get. And oh my gosh, I just, I'm so excited. I want to get to that section of the game as quickly as possible. Now, I honestly don't know what's going to happen with Nate. To my knowledge, he also does have access to a post office in the USA, in St. Petersburg, but I'm not exactly sure if I can send items to Inaho or to Nate. Like, does it work like that? I'm actually not too sure. I'd imagine not so, but eh, it'd be kind of weird if you couldn't, like, get all the yokai on one file. I don't know. Maybe I can trade between Inaho and Nate later on at, like, the late, late game of Yokai Watch 3, but I guess we'll see. But for right now, we actually need to head inside of our school, and oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh, it's taking me down memory lane. Not really considering it happened. I played this game for the first time like in October of last year. It wasn't really that long ago, but whatever. And um, hello there. And, uh, mister, your head kind of looks like a donut. Kind oh, wow. He literally does look like a rice bowl. <laughs> um, hey, do you know where the library is? Uh, I just moved here. I don't know where anything is. Oh, really? Uh, in that case, don't worry about it. Uh, sorry, couldn't be more help. Is there anything else you need? Uh, do you happen to have a detective outfit? I don't think you would have access to that, you know. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> Anyways, uh, no, I'm good. Have a good day, Mr. Rice Ball Head guy. Yeah, there's actually a lot of characters in Yoka have rice ball heads, come to think of it, but I've actually never had a rice ball. Holy crud, I just now realized that, but anyways, we gotta go library. I don't think I know why, but we got to win. Oh my gosh, look at all the blue! Ooh, what the heck is that? Ooh. Apparently, Inaho is eyeing something and... Uh, wait, do I know you? Could it be? <gasps> my best friend in the entire universe! Um, who the heck are you? Oh, I guess not. Wow, that's awkward. Uh, sorry about that. I thought you were someone else. Uh, <laughs> whatever they were talking about was the most awkward thing ever. Wait, what is that? The plot! Oh my gosh, this is supposed to happen! Lady, calm down. It's just a purse with a bunny on uh, Okay, it is pretty darn cool, and oh my gosh, is that... It is! It's what I've been looking for! To aid the plot, I guess this is Inaho's, but she left it here or something, and her mom told her to get... Oh. You think this purse is cuter than me? Theta mode. <laughs> well, look at those skills, dude! Ah, it's not, I didn't say that! Oh my gosh, well, um... I have many questions, and uh, sorry, uh, I mean, you're still the best Usapion, but uh, yeah, I kinda need that back, so don't shoot me and fine, whatever. Wait, why don't I make, why don't I make an Usapion sound like that, and oh, looks like she found something else he likes. <gasps> this is exactly what I'm looking for. Apparently, there's a detective agency purchase thing. Wait, didn't you have this in the beginning of the game? No, she just had the hat and what the heck is going- What even is this chapter, dude? I have legitimately no idea, bro. All right, but uh, let's go to Mount Wildwood now. Wait, why? I mean, I wanna go crack a machine too and th that's why we're going, Dumbo. Okay, whatever. Let's do it. I actually really do hope I can access the Cranky Kai machine. For those who don't know, I am playing... Oh my gosh, I hate to say this every video. I am playing ahead, but at the same time, uh, there are certain points in the game that basically auto-save the game for you, and that's usually not a thing with 3DS games, or at least the 3DS games that I play. So, making a playthrough of this game has been especially tricky, and how do I get to Mount Wildwood? I don't want to go the long way, and eh, don't worry about it. I'll show you the good way. All right, sounds good to me. Just follow the arrows, and then we'll get the Crankakai. Yeah, that's literally all. I have a one-track mind when it comes to Crankakai. I got these super exclusive coins, and I don't want to stick and use them, man, and I am, and I don't even think we're going to be able to use actually all the coins, and 
you know, it's kind of unfortunate that, you know, I mean, I like Inaho a lot. She's actually made me laugh a lot, and I guess she's a somewhat relatable character, I guess, for some. Totally not me, guys. <laughs> Anyways, but, uh, I just, I don't know. I just feel it's a bit weird. Nate's just been kind of hanging, and I'm like, what's going on with his story? A couple of my friends have also been playing this game and had similar complaints, but I'm not saying, like, the dual protagonist thing's a bad thing. I'm just a bit confused by it, but, uh, oh, man. We're back here, where it all started. Oh my gosh. Anyways. The crank! I can't! Oh my gosh. Alright, where'd I put those coins at? Crud, I left them in the library! Don't worry, I picked them up because I realized you lost them. Anyways, let's put these suckers in. Alright, and uh, Usapion gives us a blue coin since he's of the Shady Tribe and awesome. So just like the uh, Cranky Kai machine back in America, and it's not actually called Cranky Kai, it's like the Dream Wheel or something. We can see the rewards before we put the coin in, which is awesome, and oh my gosh, thank you for the present, Usapion. You're the best. Now let's hope we get something good. So, we got a lot of coins. I have no idea what we're getting it into, and... Um... You weren't about to activate that Cranky Kai, were you? How do you know it's a Cranky Kai? Uh... Well, okay, we'll just ignore that, but, uh... What the heck? What's wrong? If you want to use the Cranky Kai, you gotta go through me. I'm the zone! And I... Uh, I'll play a stupid mini game. I don't want to play a mini game. I just want to put the coins in. Too bad you gotta play the game. You gotta... You gotta throw the dart and time it right to get the maximum amount of Cranky Kai tries. I think this is how it works. I just legit don't know. I don't even know who this guy... Why does his head look like an egg? Sir, your head is very distracting and... Alright, fine. We'll play your dumb game. But why do we gotta do it? Wait, we can get up to 30 tries in the Crank Akai? Yeah, it's pretty cool, ain't it? It is, thank you so much for playing you play your stupid game. Usapion, this is the best day ever. <laughs> yeah, it kind of is, because the Crank Akai used to be a giant pain in the butt, but I guess they're letting us have a chance at more tries a day, if I think I'm understanding things correctly. And let's check it out, dude. All right, so I have like four medals right now. And I believe, or coins, not medals, but uh, we gotta do a crank a Kai. It's, it's, let's try it. Let's, let's think and save our game and th throw the dart. So let's hope we get a lot of tries. More than more than one would be nice, and we gotta use the bottom screen and. Uh! Okay, okay, what we get, what we get, what we get. I think I got. No, I think I got a three. Ah, oh, I got a three. Bummer. Well, that's not bad, I guess. I was so close to the seven, but oh well. I guess we get three tries of the crank a Kai machine. So. Our blue coin can give us a rare amulet, and also, come on, come on, which is a really cool yokai. Oh my gosh! Our five-star coin can get us what looks like Blazaria, but she's like fire? Then there's Red J and a boss yokai, no way! Our sushi me- Dude, okay, okay, okay. So let's, uh, Let's settle down, let's settle down. All right, so let's think about this. That, I don't want to use that at all, so I'm not going to do that. The five-star coin looks like the craziest, so I'm going to use that last. What should we use first, though? Okay. I think I'm going to go with the sushi coin first and see what we get. Okay, this is pretty sick and awesome. All right, so turn it. Oh, my gosh. Our first Cranky Kai coin of Yokai Watch 3, and it's a gold capsule. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, okay, I was really hoping to get that one. I don't know who you are, but you look insanely awesome. Hands down, one of my favorite yokai, yokai watch three. This dude, I have no idea what his name is. Stundoji. Stundoji. Oh my gosh, I. <laughs> he looks so stinking awesome. Like, okay, I'm gonna nickname him, but actually in his kanji. So I'll be right back once I go look that up. Oh, <laughs> this is so awesome. This classic yokai is called Shuten Doji, and sadly his full name will not fit, but basically from what I can gather, he was like a leader of a bunch of bandits and could beat up an oni with his bare hands. But he also drank a lot, but now he switched to sports drinks. I cannot believe I got this guy. I am so happy about that because, first off, he just looks absolutely amazing, and yeah, Shutendo actually looks a lot like a Nintendo now that I think about it. But yeah, the fact that he's red, the fact that he's a classic yokai and a mysterious tribe, which is one of my favorites, how could I not want this guy? And ooh, 
he's a part of the medallion for legendary. Oh my gosh. All right, so we got that taken care of. Yeah, he is definitely going to be a permanent team member. And oh my gosh, that's the coolest thing in the world. I bet we're going to get awesome yokai, aren't we, Usapion? They better not be awesomer than me and eventually replace me on the team. That was no one could ever replace you. All right, we got another try. Let's give it a shot. And mm, you better mean that. Anyways, <laughs> come on, let's go. I want to. I want to try in another part of the Cranky Kai. Okay, I guess we can leave now. But I really don't want to leave. I want to keep putting in more coins. So, okay, we got rid of one of our sushi medals. We could have potentially got a. Oh man, I don't want to spoil those. But there are some gem yawns down there. Those are really cool. Not really too interested in them. But let's try out this uh, really weird turquoise looking coin. Oh my gosh, I I can't even wait. So the game is gonna save again. Where are we getting it this time, guys? Cross your fingers. Hopefully we get another S rank. That would be. All right, we got a red. We got a red. Not the best, not the worst. Who we get? And we. Ooh, who the heck are you guys? <laughs> uh, yo, what's up, bro? We're the. Eating. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> I'm just at a loss for words. Who the heck are these guys? They're American yokai, but uh. Yeah, I can't think of a nickname for you guys. Sorry, I I have no idea. I can't even tell what tribe they're a part of. Maybe Shady or Yuri. Uh, that was really different. So not the yokai I was after, but we still got one more coin, the five star coin. And I just recently learned that two of the yokai at the very top for the gold are only playable in Yokai Watch 3 for the first time ever. So I'm really hoping we get Red J. He looks absolutely amazing. Let's hope we get the red. Not the gray. <laughs> I might just change myself. Let's hope we get a golden capsule yokai. I think that'd be awesome. So cross your fingers, boys. Come on, come on, come on. Gold, gold. It's a That's fine, too. You know what? I'll take it. I won't take that. Uh, I do not want a shirt. No, thank you. I'm slightly upset. You know what? Hey, it's fine. I've had worse tries at the Cranky Kai machine, but yeah, we gotta wait a couple while. To, before we can try again, so you know what? That that's cool. <laughs> Holy crud. Okay, so let's check. Oh man, we gotta wait. Oh, wait, he's actually in our party right now. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm fanboying a little bit, but seriously, look at this dude. Look at him. Look at those stats. Oh my gosh, this ultimate. Oh my gosh. And I don't know what the heck that is, but uh, just seriously, look at this dude. I can't get over how cool he looks, man. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna put him in my party right now. I'm sorry, Mrs. T. Um, Miss T. <laughs> get it, Miss T. Uh, they've been replaced. I know that's very upsetting. Can I view like your poses? Oh, okay, we need to give him some equipment. All right, so his highest stat appears to be spirit. His attack is very low. Lowering his defense is a bit. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Mm. And I have no clue what that shirt does, but you know what? Shuten Doji, you're absolutely insane. Holy crud, dude. I, I I gotta level him up. He he might just be a permanent party member for uh, Inaho. I really wanted to get him on Nate's side, but I'm not actually sure if I can, actually, considering he's a Japanese yokai and a classic yokai at that, but I really want to try him out in battle, so let's try and get into a fight versus... Oh, this is not what I meant to do, but you know what? Hey, I'll take the free stuff and huh... Let's try and grab some bugs. Uh. Oh my gosh, this is giving me flashbacks to like when I tried to get some of the toughest yokai to get in Yokai Watch 1. That was such a pain. All right, I guess we got to do this again. And we got a bug. I didn't want to catch a bug, but hey, I got one. That's cool. I wanted this item, which was Runaway Plus. You know what? I'll take that. Goodbye. Uh, I'm actually going to try and battle some yokai if that's okay with you guys. And there seems to be some right here. So let's give that a shot. Oh my gosh. All right, I don't think we have we seen this one before. Oh, it's was that okay? Was that deserves to get destroyed? <laughs> one of the toughest fights in the not the toughest fights, but one of the most annoying chapters in Yokai Watch One. It's all gladly be the test subject for this dude's soul ultimate Shuten Doji. I really wish I could fit his whole name. I'd abbreviate it. it. Might be kind of a stupid abbreviation too, and I'm kind of like afraid it's gonna like look like something really stupid. Like, but oh well. What more can I say? And I still haven't found the renaming guy. But okay, three was at. Chances are we're gonna get to use our soul ultimate. All right, just gotta do one of these. Easy peasy. Do it again. One more. Ah crud. There we go, and that should do it. So shooting Doji, come on, take care of that was at for me. See that soul ultimate. 
Oh my gosh, dude! What the dump was that? That was... I love this game. Oh my, and there's like fire for... I literally cannot even talk right now. This is insane. So he drank some soda and summoned a fire so... This is game of the year, dude. This is literally the coolest game I've ever played. Holy crud, I'm in love with that. That is... That might be my favorite yokai ever. I'm not. I'm no. I know we're very we're very early into the game, but holy crud, dude, that was legit intense. Okay, oh, uh, <laughs> don't want to progress anymore. I honestly just want to level up that yokai. But anyways, in the next video, uh, now that I'm done fanboying over Cranky Kai exclusive yokai, I guess we're gonna progress Inaho's story a bit and also see more of Shuten Doji. And he's probably going to take the limelight from, like, all the rank E and D yokai we're going to get. But I don't care. I hope you guys are cool with me using him. And stop, John. I'm trying to do the outro. Just gonna... Thank you. Anyways, see you guys in the next video where we show off more of Shuten Doji. And probably progress the plot with Inaho. So thank you all so much for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye.